Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. This seems to be like an everyday thing when we're on the road. Get up, play a whole lot, because you know you're going to get stuffed in a car. Do you know you're yeah. going to get stuffed in a car? Yeah? Make it. Woo! Good job. All right, we're packing up. We're hitting the road. Uh, we're still in Montana right now. We are heading to Bismarck, North Dakota. It is about a nine hour drive. We do plan on stopping a few places, so we'll probably roll in really late to North Dakota tonight, which isn't too bad. Um, I forgot what I was saying. I was gonna tell you to use your inside voice, but I, but I forgot. All right, let's get ready to roll. That's a really pretty lake over there. I think we're getting to the end of our mountainous view. Once we get out of Montana, I don't think we're gonna see too many more mountains. Yeah. To enjoy it while we can. I would come back here. I would like to spend more time here. I think so far this has been my favorite state. Yeah. I think so. <laughs> Even this is pretty. I mean, it, it, at least it's not flat. <laughs> well, kind of flat. I mean, it's flat and a big hill. But there's like mountains. Yeah. And apparently a lake. Kira's back there playing with all her toys. We brought her a whole bunch of stuff to chew on and play with back here. She's been back there chewing. Don't chew, chew. And that's not yours, though. Hey, don't chew on that. But I could chew on this, guys. I could. Hi, Zelbers. Memphis is right here sleeping. The girl's ready to be on the road again for a while today. Yeah. All right. Let's rock and roll. There's some snowy mountains over there behind us. And then there's some more mountains over there. I don't know if we'll be able to see the ones, but there's some snowy mountains right there as well. So apparently we get one last good look at some snowy mountains before. I mean, we're not even halfway through Montana, but I know Montana starts to get pretty darn flat once we get to that side of it. So we're gonna enjoy these snowy mountains while we can. <laughs> Yellowstone National Park is that way. Somewhere. And look, more snow in the mountains. <sighs> we can retire here. <laughs> Changing your mind from the UP. Yeah, I think we should just come back here. Yeah, I bet there's a lot of waterfalls that we've missed. I know there's so much that we've missed. We need more time. <laughs> <laughs> so through all the bugs on the windshield, can you guys see all the bugs yeah. on the windshield? Wait, slow down. We have made it to North Dakota! Legendary. That's what their sign says. We're, in, we're on 94 for anybody wondering. Everybody told me that North Dakota and that the... Everybody told me that this side of Montana was super flat and it really, it wasn't. But I think it's because we're on 94 and not 90. Right. So anyway, this is North Dakota. It looks a lot like the state we were just driving through past a little while here. Uh, and there's another bug on the windshield. Yeah. We just keep on yeah. There's so many. <sighs> and we're just a clipping along. So, my Jeep has this really cool feature. I don't know if it's as cool as I thought anymore. I mean, I guess it's cool because how else would we have known we're not listening to the local radio. Right. So anyway, my Jeep has this really cool feature that has weather map on it and it tells us when crazy weather is happening. You see, <laughs> well, within a couple <laughs> minutes, we're going to be under it, so... So this is where the warning area is. We're literally driving straight into it, and it's warning us about a tornado. It's a tornado watch, not a tornado warning. So... Right, so the conditions are there, nothing's been spotted. Nothing has been spotted yet. All I see is bugs. All yeah, I see is right. bugs. I get that feeling. So we're driving through tornado country, apparently. We're in North Dakota going through some tornado country. What do you think, girls? Are you watching for a tornado? Is that what you're doing? She's like, no, I'm watching for some snacks. And the princess, the little puppy, oh my gosh, is she upside down back there? Yep, kind of happened. Puppy stole your seat, huh? Yeah, she did. Like, guys, they make that seat specifically for me, and Kira stole it, and I'm not happy. <laughs> Don't worry, she'll move soon. We made it to the hotel in Bismarck, North Dakota, and we found out that this hotel just opened a week ago. Just opened a week ago. Um, but they're having some type of tournament in town. So we only get one bed. We all gotta share one bed. Does that sound good? 
That actually folds out into a bed, so we'll probably fold that out into a bed. What does the view look like through the screen? I don't know, what does it look like not through the screen? Ooh, look at that, we can look right down on people down there. It's a nice, nice hotel. Looks like all the other ones we've been in, doesn't it? And of course the dogs are already going crazy. Of course. Are you girls going stir crazy? Are you stir crazy after being in the car for nine and a half hours? Today was a long travel day. Long travel days are hard. Because we get to the hotels and they just want to do so much stuff. And unfortunately where we're at, it is 85 degrees outside with 91% humidity. So it's not like we can even go out and do a bunch of walking like we have been doing at night. We pretty much have to chill out in here so the dogs don't overheat. Right? You drank too much water too fast. Too much water too fast. Yeah? Yeah? Ah. <sighs> so tomorrow we head to Minnesota. We got a friend that's coming to see us in Minnesota tomorrow. And then the next day we head home. From where we're staying in Minnesota to home is a 10 hour drive, which kind of sucks, but we will make do, won't we? We will make do. We all got so tired last night, we forgot to say goodnight. It's already morning, but we all still look sleepy, don't we? Look at, we're all sleepy. So we're gonna go ahead and call it a night. <laughs> All right, you guys, we hope you enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Good night, audience. If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs and join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs.